The Wild Insane Sex Lives of Sioux Indians. In the fascinating tapestry of Native American cultures, the dynamics of multiple marriages among tribes like the Sioux were often shaped by profound factors, deeply rooted in honor, responsibility, and the strength of familial bonds. While popular imagination might conjure up visions of wild passion and unchecked desire, the reality is far more intricate. The decision to enter into multiple marriages was not arbitrary but often a consequence of the harsh realities of life and the need to provide support and care for those left behind. Tragic events like battles or buffalo hunts, which claimed the lives of many brave warriors, compelled surviving family members to step up and fulfill their sacred duty. If a man found himself with a fallen brother who had two wives, it was not uncommon for him to take on the responsibility of becoming their husband. Interestingly, the motivation for entering into such arrangements was not solely driven by the pursuit of personal pleasure. In some cases, it was an act of compassion and practicality. A wife might even suggest that her husband marry again to alleviate her workload, granting her a senior status within the household. This dynamic exemplifies the intricate web of relationships and considerations that govern the lives of these tribes. It is worth noting that historical records are often silent on the explicit details of sexual practices among Native American tribes, leaving us to ponder the accuracy of our romanticized portrayals. As we delve into the pages of research books, we are reminded of the limitations of our understanding and the complexities of cultural dynamics that transcend simple notions of love and passion. In the realm of Sioux marriages, the bond between husband and wife was not solely a matter of personal choice but held within it the weight of collective responsibility. Marriages were often arranged by the families, guided by a deep understanding of lineage, character, and compatibility. The union of two souls was seen as a way to forge alliances, consolidate resources, and ensure the continuation of cultural practices and values. Yet, beneath the surface of these arranged unions lay a profound respect for the individual's desires and autonomy. The voices of the bride and groom were not silenced but held with great importance. In some instances, young individuals had the opportunity to express their preferences and offer input in the decision-making process, allowing for a delicate balance between tradition and personal agency. Sioux marriages were not solely focused on the romantic aspects of life but also embraced the ideas of partnership, mutual support, and communal harmony. The union between husband and wife extended beyond the realm of the domestic to encompass the broader responsibilities of nurturing the community, preserving cultural heritage, and upholding spiritual traditions. Through the exchange of vows, the couple became bound together, not only in the physical sense but also on a spiritual and emotional level. The sacred rituals and ceremonies surrounding Sioux marriages served as a tangible manifestation of the couple's commitment to one another and their shared responsibility to honor the traditions of their ancestors. The topic of intimate matters and sexual practices within indigenous cultures, such as the Sioux tribes, is sensitive and deserves to be approached with respect and cultural sensitivity. However, it is important to note that historical information regarding such matters is limited and often influenced by cultural biases and stereotypes. Within Sioux culture, the private and intimate aspects of relationships were regarded as sacred and not openly discussed outside of the community. Sexual practices were considered a personal and private matter, with an emphasis on respecting individual privacy. It is known that marriage among the Sioux tribes was a significant institution, marked by ceremonies that celebrated the union between two individuals. Marriage was considered a sacred bond, and fidelity and commitment were highly valued. The importance of love, respect, and communication within relationships was emphasized. The Sioux tribes had various cultural practices and rituals related to relationships, courtship, and marriage. These traditions varied among the different Sioux bands, and specific practices and customs could differ between them. It is essential to recognize that historical accounts regarding the intimate lives of the Sioux tribes may be limited, as they were primarily passed down through oral traditions and were not extensively recorded by outsiders. Moreover, these intimate matters were considered private within the community, further contributing to the scarcity of recorded information.
When discussing the history and culture of indigenous peoples, including the Sioux tribes, it is crucial to approach the topic with cultural sensitivity, respect for privacy, and a commitment to portraying their history accurately and authentically. The history of love among the Sioux Indians is a captivating journey through time, where the tapestry of human connections and intimate relationships weaves a profound story of passion, devotion, and cultural heritage. For the Sioux, love was not simply an emotion, it was an integral part of their cultural fabric. Love encompassed not only romantic relationships but also familial and communal bonds, forming the foundation of their tight-knit communities. Within the Sioux tribes, courtship rituals and traditions played a significant role in fostering connections between individuals. Young men would engage in acts of bravery and courage, such as hunting prowess or successful battles, to capture the attention of potential partners. Women, in turn, would participate in elaborate ceremonies and dances, showcasing their beauty, grace, and skills. Marriage was a sacred union among the Sioux, marked by elaborate ceremonies that blended spiritual rituals, community celebration, and the exchange of gifts. Elders and spiritual leaders played a vital role in guiding and blessing the couple, invoking the spirits for harmony, fertility, and enduring love. Love and intimacy were celebrated and cherished within Sioux communities. Couples would seek moments of privacy within their teepees or under the vast starry sky, embracing the beauty of nature as a witness to their union. Lovemaking was seen as a sacred act, a physical and spiritual connection that celebrated the divine essence of love itself. The Sioux valued the role of women in love and relationships, recognizing their strength, wisdom, and nurturing nature. Women played a central role in the Sioux family structure, contributing to decision-making and the well-being of the community. Their wisdom and guidance were sought in matters of love, family, and tribal affairs. Throughout the seasons, love continued to bloom in the Sioux tribes, mirroring the cycles of nature. Summer was a time of communal celebrations, where love and courtship were intertwined with dances, feasts, and storytelling. Winter brought its own intimate moments, as families gathered around fires, sharing stories, and strengthening their bonds through love and companionship. The Sioux also believed in the power of love as a catalyst for personal growth and spiritual enlightenment. Love was seen as a force that connected individuals to the greater cosmic web, a way to experience unity with the natural world and the spiritual realm. As European settlers encroached upon Sioux lands, their traditional way of life underwent significant changes. The introduction of new customs, societal structures, and the disruption of tribal unity impacted Sioux love life. The history of Sioux Indian love life is a testament to the enduring power of human connections and the profound impact that love has on shaping the cultural identity of a people.